Reason number seven. The fifth dimension as probability space has nothing to do with mainstream science. Our goal with this project is to end up visualizing not just a multiverse landscape of the different possible universes, some string theorists say there are 10 to the power of 500 of them, but the probabilistic outcomes that quantum mechanics tells us must exist for each of those universes. Yes, I've said in my videos and book that my approach is not something you will currently be taught in a physics class. Watch the end of my video, Imagining the Fifth Dimension, for more about this. But it's still a powerful idea, and I believe its time will come. Einstein accepted Kaluza's proposal that our reality is derived from the fifth dimension, and yet that's also something you don't hear often from the mainstream. In fact, Kaluza's idea that general relativity and its depiction of gravity, along with Maxwell's field equations for electromagnetism, could be resolved at the fifth dimension, has always been an important part of my reasoning that the ongoing now of our observed reality comes not from the fourth, but from the fifth dimension. Likewise, Hugh Everett said that his branching many worlds occur within a space which is orthogonal to space-time. But it's only my project at this point that says that means the other parallel universe outcomes described by Everett's theory are within the fifth spatial dimension, because that's what's orthogonal to the fourth. And as an aside, I want to mention something you will find throughout the videos I've created. When I describe an idea which is my extrapolation, you will hear me say, with my project, so that my audience is clear on which are mainstream ideas and which are my creative thoughts on how to fit different schools of thought together into the bigger picture I'm trying to portray. And even if fifth dimension as probability space is unique to this project, it's still one of the central ideas I've been exploring for the last 30 years. Do I feel passion for this idea? You bet I do. And YouTube has helped me to share that passion with others around the world.